Hello everyone, in this few minute video we're going to show you how to edit your profile and change the frequency in which you receive notifications from Town Square. You'll notice after you log into Town Square, this is your home screen after you've logged in. And you're going to come up to this button here up on top. Now that's my name, Paul Petrulis, and this is our demo association. But to change your preferences, you want to click on your name and a drop down menu comes up and your choices are edit profile, change your community, or log out. For this video, we're just going to hit the Edit Profile button right here. What that does is it gives you opportunities here to change the frequency in which you receive your association information through Town Square. Whether it's an email for any new messages, any responses from the manager or the board, any work order service requests that you put in, and all those responses as well, this is the frequency in, in which you'll receive those notifications. You get to choose that. Do not receive is one option, meaning you're not going to receive any notifications unless you actually log in to check Town Square. Another option is individual, meaning every single time something happens that directly relates to you and your unit or the association as a whole, you'll get an individual email saying, hey, you need to log into Town Square. There's something you need to know. The Daily Digest option is a, is a condensed version once every day towards the end of the day around six o'clock that an email will come out to you saying hey this is what happened for your association all day and if you think that's too many emails you're getting you can change it to weekly meaning once a week at the end of every Friday you're going to get an email saying hey this is what happened to your association for this past week now you also have the opportunity if your association has amenities and takes reservations and does polls, you can literally turn off all of your notifications. If you don't want to get news and event notifications, you can just turn those off. Literally, it's that simple. You can turn these things off. Now, you've noticed that I changed all of these from Do Not Receive to Weekly Digest. I'm going to save this right now, and you'll notice once I save it, a green box popped up here that says it's been successfully updated. It was literally that quick. It only takes seconds to update these things. Now I actually am going to turn these back on, but from a privacy perspective, you, the unit owner, have an opportunity to stop people from seeing your home address, your telephone, and your email. The default is that all three of these are turned off. You literally, to allow people to see your e email address, your telephone, or your home address, all you would need to do is click these on and hit save. Once you get this notification box, there it is that pops up. Now anybody can see my mailing address, my telephone number, and my email in this example. Over here on this side of the screen is my information in terms of my phone numbers that can be that I can be reached at. If I want to add a phone number, I can. And down here is my email address and password. I also can link this account to Facebook. But that's it when it comes to just trying to update your profile and the frequency in which you receive your notifications down here in the middle, what kind of notifications you can turn on and turn off, and your privacy settings right here. If these are showing green, that means individuals in the association may see your home address, your telephone, and your email. If you do not want anybody to see those, simply click these off. I'm going to leave them on because it doesn't bother me in this example because it's all my work information. Uh, but in that example, this is a, all it takes to change your personal preferences on your home screen.